morning and welcome back to a brand new vlog. So today is Thursday morning. Today I'm going to be sorting out my room and basically kind of like not redoing it because I'm not redoing it but I've basically went to Ikea and I'm going to put all the vlog clips in in a second and I bought some underbed storage and I bought some wardrobe storage because I've kind of accumulated a lot of things and I'm a hoarder. I like to keep things so I needed to find some sort of way to organise it. So we went to Ikea the other day and I picked up quite a few different organization bits and we're gonna do a car boot sale tomorrow night so I can like sell some of the old stuff that I had and everything so today's vlog is basically just gonna be me kind of redoing my room but I'm gonna put in all the clips here from when I went to Ikea the other day Hey everyone, good morning and welcome back to a brand new vlog. So today is Tuesday, it's just been Sitsy weekend and I've had a little bit of a lay in today as I was really really tired. So it is 4 minutes past 10 right now and I'm so excited to have a lay in. I literally just got up out of bed, I've just had some breakfast, so I'd say I woke up at like half past 9. And then later on today we're going to be going to Ikea because I need to get some storage for underneath my bed and my wardrobe. I'm planning on doing a wardrobe video but it just needs storage, like it's just so messy. So so we're going to buy some boxes, we're going to buy some like rail things, we're going to go to Ikea and we're going to have a meal in the Ikea cafe for dinner and that's basically the plan for today. I'm not really going to be doing much else. Right now I'm just going to be tidying my room as I got back and it's a little bit of a state and I've literally fell asleep so early last night. I got in, ended my vlog and I fell asleep at 6pm and then I woke up this morning. I was just so tired. So like I said, that is what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to tidy my room, I need to unpack my case as well as I haven't done that yet and then we can film my main channel video. I'm just unpacking my case and I'm just about to read through some of the letters that you guys got me. So this is the first pile of stuff that I've got and somebody's put Anastasia's favourite foods. This is legit my favourite food though. Starbucks cheese and tomato toasty, sweet chilli sensations, Mars milkshake, caramel puddings, pot noodles, nomadic yoghurt pox, yoghurt pox? Yoghurt pots and then I've got, oh my god, the apple and the caramel sauce, the button yoghurts, the sandwiches, the chicken nuggets, this is what I mean, like you guys are actually crazy, that's literally spot on. And then I've also got this one that I took this out of the frame and it's so so cute and there's like a little message up there. And then we've got the frame and stuff, I need to sit through and actually read everybody's letters which is what I'm going to do today. But how gorgeous are all these, like thank you so much. These are all messages from you guys, all my viewers messages. And then I've got these pictures, I really like the picture. Oh that's stuck to the book of me and Haz on the front, like look how cute. And this card as well, when I open this, it's just so, so lovely. I didn't realise how many of you who had accounts on Instagram were going to be there, so thank you so much for all of this. I'm actually buying boxes at Ikea to organise through everything, so I can probably go through it all later. But again, if you didn't see my last vlog going through it as well, thank you so, so much. Put it all up! <laughs> Who's your favourite, Anna? Mal's my favourite. Who's your favourite? Harry. Harry, hook. It's the return of the wool coat. I know, I'm really glad to see it back, but it's a little bit chillier today and I don't have a jacket, so I'm just gonna wear this and I've just got on this black like bodysuit from Pretty Little Thing, which I'm gonna wear tomorrow as well because I've got meetings all day and I've just got on some black leggings as we're literally just going to Ikea, so pretty basic outfit. It's really dark, so you might not actually be able to see me properly, but we have just arrived at Ikea. We're in the car park, like the underneath car park, and we always park in this one same space. I have no idea why, but it's just like right at the back, and we're just tucked away. My mum's just outside having a cigarette, and then Atticus is asleep next to me, as you can see. I've got really bad, like these eyelashes, like I loved getting them at first, but they're really hurting my eyes now, and I feel like I've got no like real eyelashes left. These are literally just the extensions, but I'm kind of just waiting them to fall out because my eye really hurts. We're gonna head to the food bit first and we're gonna get some dinner because it's actually, well actually I don't even know what the time is, I think it's like four o'clock. I really fancy the meatballs so I'm gonna get the meatballs and I'm gonna get some chips with it and like the special sauce and stuff and then my mum will probably have the same and Atticus will just have chips as Atticus isn't a fan of the meatballs but they're so good like if you've never been to Ikea before or when you next go make sure you try the meatballs because you will love them. But the main reason that I needed to come to Ikea was basically because I needed to buy more storage for my wardrobe and under my bed because it's just really messy. I've got a lot of things from somewhere in the city that you guys have given me that I need like to put in boxes and everything and I want to organise all my letters and stuff so I need to get 
some sort of underbed storage type thing and also if I can something to put in my wardrobe that's a bit more than just boxes maybe like pull out drawers or something I don't know but I need to look for something like that so that's what we've come here mainly to get and probably also end up picking up some candles and plants as well because can you really come to Ikea without wanting to raid the plant section and here is my food I got the 10 meatballs the chips the sauce and the peas they barely gave me any peas and I really fancy peas today and then mum got the exact same as well but with the sauce and then Atticus got chips and bread roll and because kids eat free they gave us it free oh okay then first thing I found that I really like is this like succulent plastic plant thing. I love succulents but they always kind of go like dead and crispy so I've actually found a fake one now and Atticus literally just looked at me dead in the eye and went I was once like you my child. I was once like you my child. Slightly. Hello. What are you doing in the trolley? This. We made you a little den. You are mummy. You are on mummy? What? What? Mummy's later go. Mummy's gone to get another trolley. Where's her? She's gone to get another trolley because you want this one as a den. When? Uh, she'll be back in a minute. Where? In Ikea. But where is it? I'm so confused. Where do you think her is? In Ikea. Uh, in out when we got the trolley outside, do you think I got it from outside? Maybe. So my new trolley is quickly getting full up. I'm going to do you guys a proper, proper haul when I get home. But I just picked up a massive, like, shoe rack thing. I'm basically not really, like, redecorating my room. I'm just buying organisation because the under of my bed and my wardrobe is literally such a state that I need to organise it. So I've just got on, like, boxes. I've got on shoe racks. Now I just need to get two new boxes for my wardrobe as well. I've also got some underbed storage to organise like, all my bank stuff and everything and then to organise my drawers. What are we getting now, Atticus? What's mummy gone to get us? Uh, ice cream for me. Some chips and a coke for you. Clever boy. Then where are we going to go? Home. No, we're going to Asda. Because uh, we need to do food shopping, don't uh, we? Fans, you might have guessed. What? Are you now? <gasps> Atticus. I spit at the fans. No, we don't. <laughs> when you meet them in real life, you give them a hug. Because guess what? You're coming to somewhere in the city next year, aren't you? Yeah. And so is Mummy. And all the, the vlogs. Yeah, and you can meet everybody. But I can't wait to meet everybody. But... <laughs> we are now in Asda. We finished up in Ikea. We had an ice cream and then I got some chips as well. And we've now finished in there and now, like I said, we're in Asda. I've just put my drink in as well because it's so nice. I love Ikea Coke, whatever it is. I don't think it's obviously not real Coke, but Ikea's version of it. So good. And now we're just food shopping. Mum's just there and then Atticus is sitting on Mum's phone. One of my favourite things that you guys might not know about is actually tacos. So we're just buying a taco kit so we can make some. These are so good. These are the sweet paprika and garlic ones but i honestly am obsessed with tacos do we see those in my vlogs later on this week so now you would have seen that i went to ikea and i'm basically going to do you a really quick haul of what i've got and then we can kind of get into actually doing my room it's super super early right now by the way it's literally half past eight in the morning so i just got like under bed storage i got a shoe rack i got a uh, tray to go in my like dressing table here i got this storage to sort out all of my like bank stuff and all different paperwork and everything i got boxes i got plants i should actually have two more plants oh i got another plant around there that pink lantern is fine now which i'm going to drop at her house and that's basically everything that i got from ikea the first thing that i'm going to do is go into my wardrobe and i'm going to clear out everything that i don't want anymore because i haven't bought myself clothes in a very 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 long time but at the same time i also have managed to hoard her load of clothes so i need to go through all of those i'm gonna sell and give to charity a load of the ones that i don't want anymore and then i've got room for more because i'm planning on doing a clothing haul soon so i kind of need to just clear out my wardrobe so i've got room and then i'm gonna do under my bed and under my bed is definitely gonna be the biggest task of today because it's just so messy under there there's so much stuff and i need to find a better way to organize it and then later on today we're gonna pop over to home sense which will be really nice and then we'll probably go to like starbucks and get a drink or something just me my mum or Atticus his dad has Atticus for the afternoon so first thing I need to do is my wardrobe this is the situation on my wardrobe at the moment as you can see there's just boxes and boxes of stuff like a 
it's got to the point where I don't have room to hang anything up anymore so I've had to put it in boxes and I'm actually going to get rid of these two boxes down here and I'm going to put a shoe rack there in a little box and then just keep these two so I need to organize all of that and then obviously I've got all of this as well so I'll show you the pile as it starts to build up. Okay so I actually didn't really think there was going to be many clothes that I was going to be recycling but apparently I've got this massive massive pile here. This is the pile of clothes that I'm keeping but I need to hang them all back up because I just ripped everything off the hangers so I can organize my hangers. Wow I love doing this at 9am in the morning. Okay my wardrobe is filling up a little bit now. That is how many clothes in total that I'm keeping. It probably doesn't look as though I've chucked away that many but in reality I had a lot of clothes folded up in these two boxes and I also had two boxes down here but I'm literally just going through those now. But I really have got rid of a lot of clothes and I'm really really excited to do a car boot sale. We were meant to be doing it tomorrow night but it's on every fortnight so I'm not actually going to be doing it until next Friday so I've got a lot of clothes in bags and this box is full as well um, to go to the car boot sale but that is so much better because all the clothes in there I know I will wear like a hundred percent I will wear and now I've got room to go and buy some more clothes as well like I just literally had no room whatsoever so now I'm going through my shoe box so I've just basically going through all my heels and shoes that I want to keep that's not even a shoe I mean what even is that this is what I mean it's just so so messy I know you can't see my head right now but I actually bought this shoe rack from Ikea the other day and it was only three pounds and it's literally just this like wire black shoe rack and then you just pop that up and I think it's so cool but three pounds I really don't think you can go wrong with this and I've got a lot of shoes but like because I keep them in a box I feel like you guys need to see me but because I keep them in a box then I don't really wear them but now I'm gonna have them like displayed in my wardrobe it will make me want to wear them all I've also got a lot more shoes downstairs as well because I keep the majority of my shoes downstairs but I'm gonna bring them up and then again just kind of dispose of the ones that I don't normally wear so I think I've like disposed of like six or seven pairs so far and there will definitely be more that I'm gonna sell as well and that is what it looks like at the bottom now I've put the shoe rack in and then I've put three of my heels on that I'm actually keeping I've got some white ones some like heeled boots and then some little black heels and then I've put my sunglasses down here and then I've just got this little potted plant at the back but it looks like this and that's so much better so I'm just gonna go grab my trainers from downstairs and then that will finish off my wardrobe and here is my finished wardrobe I actually just swapped out my sunglasses for my Louis Vuitton bag just because I wanted to kind of like display it and then I've got my six pairs of shoes that I always always wear so I've got my three pairs of heels that I always wear and then I've got my three pairs of trainers I've got the Gucci ones I've got the Air Force and then I've got my feeler ones I'm aware that my Gucci and my Air Force really need some cleaning and I am going to do that in a second as well and then I've also got my little plant back there so that looks 10 times better to what it did so now I need to finish charging the rest of my room and then I'm going to go for under my bed it's time to do under my bed and this is literally what is going to take me so long. So I've got loads of parcels that I need to go through here. I've got rubbish piles over here and I've got these boxes that I've got here that I got from Ikea and I'm just going to pop these up now and they're like these little under bed slidey boxes and I'm going to try and organise everything into these two boxes. It was literally three pounds and you just pop it up like this. You just push the sides out and then and you just push the sides out and then you just pop this over and zip it up. It's so so good. So now I need to try and condense everything into two of these. This one's the smallest of them. I do have a bigger one as well. Everybody's getting involved now in helping me do my room. So we've done underneath of my bed. That's basically all done now. I've got my two white boxes there and then I've got my little office-y thing where I'm going to keep all my bank stuff and everything that I need. Now I'm just going over all of my bed and everything. I've got a load of PO box stuff to go through and this is all the stuff that we're currently just sorting through and I've also got to go through all of this. We just have so much to do. What is that? Here's my yucky now it's time to go through some P.O. Box goodies. So I got sent this massive PR package, which is from Simple. It's the coolest thing ever. It's literally a massive pack of face wipes, and then you open it, and inside is all of the new Little Mix Simple skincare range. So I love Simple stuff anyway, so I'm definitely going to be trying all this out. I'm going to pop it in the bathroom in a minute, but thank you so, so much for Simple. I'm well excited to try this. And how cool are the new Dior foundations that they've sent me? The bottles are like silicone. I can't explain it, but they're like squidgy silicone. It's so cool. They're silicone, but they feel expensive. So 
I love it. I just jumped out of the bath and now I'm going to do my makeup. I've got all of my makeup just sat here. I put it in this tray as well, which I'm so excited about because it means I can just pull this tray out my drawer every morning and then just do my makeup from here. And I've also grabbed a bunch of my Too Faced products because today I'm going to be doing a full face of Too Faced makeup. So I'm going to be using their brand new palette here. This isn't sponsored, but I am doing a sponsored Instagram post for them, which is like ridiculously exciting. So I'm using their palette today and I'm using all of their makeup so I've got the born this way foundation they sent me some of them to use and then I'm also using their concealer and I already had a load of Too Faced products anyway like their mascara powder blush I've literally got everything so I'm so so excited to do this and I'm so excited to look for the looks that I'm going to create also you just saw my toenails that's absolutely disgusting I'm kind of feeling a look like this. I feel like that would look really nice. And I can do it with these two colours here. Maybe a little bit of that one. Then use some of this pink and use some of this gold. Because I just swatched the pink and look how incredible that is. That was one swatch. Like, oh. I've just finished my makeup. I actually did do a really extravagant eye look, but I don't want to show you guys. So I literally wiped it off and I've still just got my eyelash extensions on and I just popped some mascara over them. I actually really want them to fall out now though, because I really want to start growing back my natural lashes. Atticus, what are you doing? What are you doing? I can just see you hiding. Hello. You going You going out with daddy? Yeah. Yeah. And here is today's finished look. I've got on some black jeans from Topshop. I've got on a sunflower top, which is from Romwe. It's just like part of a co-ord. And then I've just finished curling my hair. I wasn't going to do anything with my hair. And then we're just waiting for Atticus's dad to come. So I was like, you know what? I've got like a spare five, ten minutes. I'll just quickly pop some curls through it. So I just use the... Actually, I get this all the time. I use the Mark Hill Curler. It's amazing. Like, I literally did this in five minutes. Now, don't get me wrong. I don't have any hairspray, so it probably will drop out. But it looks so good. And I want to get a new Instagram picture today. So I thought curly hair it is. We are about to leave. And I actually just saw basically Atticus has got a baby brother with like his dad and his like wife and everything. And um, he's so, so cute. His name is Sebastian. And I haven't seen him for the longest time. And his dad just brought him in. And he can now walk. Like it's so, so weird. I love babies so much. And it's strange because before my mum had Atticus, I never like got to spend time with a baby. Just because we didn't really have any in our family. There was like no babies that I could see. Um, and now I Obviously, I've grown up with Atticus, who's now four. Who's so he'll be five in April next year. And then, obviously, I just saw Sebastian, so that's so cute. But they're just driving off now, which means we're going to go. So we're going to head over to HomeSense, where I need to pick up some bits for a video. We've just made a stop at Starbucks, and I decided to get the brand new caramel cheese cheese. Oh, caramel cheese cake. Oh, it's really it looks like cheese. It's the caramel cheesecake frappuccino, and it's amazing. Like. Oh my god, it literally tastes like caramel cheesecake. So if you're a fan of cheesecake, recommend this like a lot. And here is our dinner. Mum's trying us out to dinner in Morrison's Cafe. So I've got two slices of garlic bread, which are kind of like hiding underneath the plate. I can't get them. And then I got mac and cheese because I've been telling everybody that I've got an obsession with mac and cheese at the moment. And then mum got, I don't actually exactly know what's in that pie. I'm pretty sure it's steak and ale or chicken and ale. Mum, what was in that pie? Is it steak and ale in that pie? Steak and ale. Steak yeah. and ale and then mashed potato and peas. Um, Morrison's. I got Attica some Disney slime. Which, was it the last one? It was the last, last one. one. I bet you they do Belle slime. So, uh, it was another day we can go and if we see Belle, you'll buy me. Yeah, yeah, I bet they do yellow but, Belle slime. But, Mum, I love this. So Are you happy with it? Yeah, thanks. She's been saying to me, can we make slime for so long, haven't you? Yeah. Well, I don't know how to make slime. Yeah, but later I have got some. Me and Natticus could make some for a video. Yeah, he'd like to make some slime. Can I take it out? Yeah, just Go get on. your hand and grab it. Like, don't help you? Yeah. Oh, I love slime. <laughs> oh! Yeah. He, never, he never used to like it. He doesn't. <laughs> You like it? Yeah. Slime. <laughs> <laughs> that what Romeo done. Oh yeah, he slimes him, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah. That's what Romeo done. Yeah. yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. yeah. What did Romeo give her? Oh. Slime. Oh, mum. <laughs> oh. I love slime. <laughs> Is there any more? No, that's all of it. You can keep it in your little pot. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.